his shape. Flex actually wow. began as a lanky middleweight, then built himself up to a light heavyweight. At 5'10", 190 pounds, the 23-year-old Wheeler won his first big contest, the coveted NPC California Championships in 1989. And how many times do you see a man go into a full split? I've never seen you do that. No, no, not in my wildest dreams. That was that was an F, I think, for Flex. F L and Flex the, uh, then the made his move to national Forever. level competition, competing the in the 1989 weeks. Nationals yeah, in Miami. Although size-wise, he didn't yet match up. His perfect We're shape was already Flex beginning Wheeler, to catch the judges' attention. California in the light heavyweight division, and dramatic as it gets, right? <laughs> uh, He's having fun. He sure is. The audience loves it. Flex knew that if he was to fulfill his dream of turning professional, he would need more size. So he trained heavy and added enough mass to move into the heavyweight division. He unveiled his new size at the 1990 Junior Nationals in New Orleans. After a disappointing second place finish, Flex Wheeler decided to put on a little more size. It was also becoming clear that he would need to get slightly more defined to earn the elusive pro card. He entered the 1991 USA in his backyard of Santa Monica. Flex gave himself one more shot. If he didn't win the 1992 USA, he would return to a career in law enforcement and resume his studies of the martial arts. He put everything he had into his preparations for the show, and it paid off. Flex was now a professional, but had to start all over again and prove himself in the pro ranks. He targeted the 1993 Pro Ironman as his first pro show and brought his muscular body weight up to 230 pounds. Ironman, Flex flew to Columbus, Ohio for the prestigious Arnold Schwarzenegger Classic. Unfortunately for veterans like Lee Labrada, Vince Taylor, and J.J. Marsh, he was in even better condition than he had been the week before. It was another Wheeler shutout. The flexibility of a dancer in the audience really appreciates it. Flex had just one more obstacle ahead of him, the Mr. Olympia contest. Here, the competition would be much tougher, especially with the addition of reigning Mr. Olympia, Dorian Yates. Critics said that the spring events had burned Flex out, and that he had no hopes of coming into the Olympia in top shape. Flex had won his first four pro shows and placed second in his first Mr. Olympia. Not only was this unprecedented in the world of bodybuilding, but in the eyes of his fans worldwide, Flex Wheeler was number one in the sport of bodybuilding.